There are thousands of very curious stars in our galaxy, the Milky Way, called neutron stars. They weigh as much as the sun, but are as small as a city, like Amsterdam. Imagine taking all the material that makes up our enormous star and squeezing it together until it were a ball just about 12 miles wide. You'd get a neutron star. Things around us are made of tiny, tiny pieces called atoms, which themselves are made up of even tinier pieces. A cloud of electrons orbiting a small nucleus of neutrons and protons. In neutron stars, atoms get squashed together so much that the electrons get crushed into the nucleus, and then protons capture the electrons to form neutrons. The further into the centre of the star, the more crushed together everything is. It gets really crowded in there. In neutron stars, gravity is also weird. On Earth, gravity nicely holds us to the surface and pulls us back down when we jump in the air. On neutron stars, gravity is 100 billion times stronger. It's so strong that if an alien dropped a phone just one metre above the star, it would hit the surface in one millionth of a second, getting completely destroyed. Neutron stars are also incredibly strong magnets, up to 1,000 billion times stronger than the ones we use to stick stuff to our fridge. These magnetic fields cause explosions in the star that release radiation in incredible amounts. These blasts can be so big that they affect the Earth's atmosphere. Even though they come from neutron stars, millions and millions of miles away, if all of this sounds strange, it's because it is. Neutron stars are nothing like what we have here on Earth and are some of the most incredibly strange things in the universe. But this is what makes them special. They allow astronomers to study the physics at the limits of our imagination, from gravity to magnets to the very tiniest particles that make up everything around us. Neutron stars put the physics into astrophysics.